And what breaks my heart is there's so many people out here, you just don't get it. Everything you're looking for is in him. Everything. Everything you think he's not, he is. Everything you think, everything you think is this, this worthless, raggedy, treacherous, wicked world is going to give you. He would hand it to you. If you just lay your life down. And what's crazy is, is, is we get so afraid when we talk like that. Like, like as if the life that we live in without him is something to even hold on to. It's technically not even life. There's no fulfillment. There's no satisfaction. There's no purpose. If you are not in Christ, brother, sister, if you're not in Christ, let me tell you something. You're not living. You're just enjoying death. Come on. You've been convinced that death is enjoyable. You could be alive today. Hallelujah. Jesus. That void, that thing could be settled. It could be filled. That, that past that you can't let go of, that hurt that you just can't get over, he could take it from you. That addiction, he'll lift it up off of you, man. I'm telling you, I was on air run. Come on. OD died. Portman floor, 18 hours. Flat line, blind, deaf, woke up, hallucinated for three days, mind gone. God brought me back. Come on. Hallelujah. Alcoholic. I've been sober for six years. Fornicated with the best of them. Been celibate for six years. Yes, I struggle. Yes, I stumble. But in Him, I'm free, man. And I don't have to do nothing. When this flesh calls me, I don't have to go to. Like I used to. I used to, I used to not be able to resist. I remember doing dirt and crying while I was doing it. Because I didn't want to do what I was about to do, but I'm going to do it anyway. I remember one time in an apartment, I'm drinking. I'm drinking a gallon of ENJ with a gun to my head, trying to get drunk enough to pull the trigger, praying that God would leave me so I could kill myself, begging God to remove his spirit from me so I could die. That's what I was. Don't tell me what God can't do. Glory to God. 